Hi everyone, today I'm going to be showing you how to use your Lucid Light e-glasses. First, to charge the glasses, you'll connect the included cable to each arm. It'll clip on just like so. It doesn't matter which end of the cable you connect to which arm. You'll see a red light come on each arm. That means the glasses are charging. When that red light turns off, the glasses are done charging and ready for use. When you disconnect the glasses, it'll automatically power on and be ready to pair. So just look for Lucid Light on your Bluetooth menu and you'll be ready to use your glasses. Once connected, the glasses will act just like wireless headphones and play out any audio from your device and the microphone will be activated for phone calls. Once the glasses are on, you can turn them off by pressing either touch button for about five seconds. You'll hear power off once the glasses are off. To turn the glasses back on without disconnecting them from the cable, you hold both touch buttons for about three seconds. You'll then hear power on and the glasses will automatically reconnect the last device that you paired them to. So if you want to connect to a different device, be sure to delete that Bluetooth connection and start over on the new device. Now that the glasses are paired up and ready to go, I'll show you how to use the different touch controls, which are all managed by these two touch buttons on the glasses. To go down one volume notch, you'll press the left touch button once. Be sure to leave about one second between each press as you're reducing volume. To raise the volume, you'll press the right button once. That'll raise it one notch, wait a second, and then press it again to go up another volume notch. Now to play or pause your music, you'll double tap either of the touch buttons quickly like so. That will pause your music or start playing it again if it was paused. To skip forward and back tracks, you can also use the touch buttons. Use the left button uh, by clicking it three times quickly, and that will skip back a track on the album you're listening to, and click the right button three times quickly to skip forward a track on the album you're listening to. Now, to activate the voice assistant like Siri or Google Voice, you'll press either touch button for about two seconds. After you hold it for about two seconds, wait for the voice assistant prompt and then speak. You can press the button again for another two seconds to cancel the voice assistant. To answer a call on the glasses, you'll double click either button. So just click twice quickly to answer an incoming phone call. To reject an incoming phone call, you'll hold either touch button for about two seconds. Once you're on a call, you can double click again to hang up. Now I'll show you how to adjust your Lucid Light glasses. While most adjustments are best done by your local optician, you can adjust the front plate yourself by bending inwards or outwards at the bridge to change the tightness or looseness of the glasses. To make the glasses fit looser, place your fingers under the front of the frame like so, and then outwards at the bridge. This will widen the angle of the arms and make the glasses fit a little bit looser. To tighten the glasses, you'll bend inwards at the bridge, and this will tighten the angle of the arms and make the glasses fit a little bit tighter. Again, we do recommend taking your glasses into your local optician to have any front plate adjustments done, but you can do these quick adjustments at home to make the glasses fit a little bit better. Now we'll discuss swapping lenses on your Lucid Light. While we don't ever recommend swapping prescription lenses yourself, you can easily change out non-prescription lenses by hand. For example, if you purchase the Light 3 lens pack. To remove the lenses on your glasses, just hold them like so, and pop out from the bottom part of the lens. It's very easy, it should only take about a second to pop them out using your thumbs and pushing on the bottom of the inside of the frame. Now to install the new lenses, we'll do it from the front of the frame by first fitting it into the top of the frame and then working our way around and pushing it in. You'll hear a click when the lens is fully installed. So again, you'll start from the top, fit it into the top of the frame there and then push it in around the rim until you hear a click. Then your new lenses are installed and ready to go. Now I'll show you how to store your Lucid Light in the included case. First, take the case and open it up like so. Then insert the glasses upside down with the lenses facing away from you. Then you can just close the case like that and the magnet will keep it shut. 